So in this video, I'm going to show you how to limit internet on any device connected to your Virgin router, like a phone or a tablet or even a PC. So, so please like and sub and uh, we'll get started right after this intro. Right, so this is for the Virgin Media Hub 3.0. Um, if you're not sure what router you've got, um, here's a picture and it should say 3.0 on the bottom. So first we need to log into the router itself um, and to do that we uh, open a browser and in the browser we type 192.168 what? Let's try that again 168.0.2 as you can see it's already there and I've logged in and then you press enter and you should be welcomed with the Virgin Media router login screen where you can check your router status and stuff like that. Right, so you need the password um, to log in and the password is on the bottom of your router. So here's a picture of it rolling around. And it is the, is it the settings password? You type it in there. And don't worry, you can lean your router on its side and while it's still connected, it won't harm it. Um, my advice is just take a picture of it with your phone and then you can come to your laptop computer and type it in. So because mine's already saved and I changed it earlier, we can log straight in. So once you've done that, we shall log in. So when you log in, you'll come to a welcome screen. Main welcome screen. And just let everything load up and do its thing. There we go. And then what you want to do is you want to go to advanced settings on the left. And then to security. And then further down to Mac filtering. So once you've got Mac filtering, it will bring up a list of um, currently connected um, devices <coughs> to your router. So um, let's say I want to limit internet access to my phone, which is the only thing connected to the Wi-Fi on 5G, this one. Um, yours will not say a device name. Yours will probably say unknown, unknown, unknown. But on the first page, the welcome page, you can click the device and rename it to whatever. But you'll have to find out what the Mac address is for each device. So. I cheated here and I disconnected everything with Wi-Fi so I could find my phone, which is that one. So I know it's FA with 24 at the end of it. Um, you'll have to probably look on the back of your devices or bottom of the devices for their MAC address. Um, if it's Android, you will probably have to go into the settings and somewhere in the info. Same with um, Apple. I'm not sure. You'll have to go into settings to find the MAC address, but you do need it. Otherwise, this won't work. Right, so you once you find out which device is yours, tick it, it puts it in the add filter rule. You can also manually enter the MAC address if it's not showing up there, but it should show up there. And then once it's in there, you want to click add rule. And then it'll disappear for a second. And then it should pop back. And then you want to scroll down, as you can see, it's added it to the MAC filter list. Manta, there you go. Now, yours will probably say always on. So what you want to do is you want to, oh yeah, by the way, this is the enable thing. So anything that's ticked here will be enabled in the list. Um, so what you want to do is you want to click, I only want to restrict internet access at so-and-so. And then this will give you a time, a set time every day. But if you wanted to limit internet access for school nights, or work nights to say a certain time like 8 p.m. and then on weekends it can be on till 9 p.m. or 10 p.m. then what you want to do is click at different times on different days of the week so you click this and then you can decide what time it goes off so let's for instance I want it to go off at 8 o'clock on a Monday I'd take the 8 up till 11 um, so if you don't want it to come back on until 8 o'clock in the morning, you'd have to go to this side and put it there. 
So I'm going to do the same for every weekday. Shouldn't take me long. Except for Friday. I'm going to have it say cut off at 9. Sun Saturday, 9. And Sunday, that's more or less a school night, in it? Bed early for school next day or work or whatever. So Sunday is going to go off at 8. And then obviously in the morning as well you don't want to you don't want them waking up at two in the morning and think oh internet's back on after 11 and then once you've done that you click upload changes and then give it a couple of seconds and this works instantly so if you actually do it at 11 o'clock at night and you want it to go off at nine anyway and you activate it the internet will go straight off the only downside with this is if you have two devices you can't set it for each one it's a setting for all so you can't pick like different times for the tablet and that'll go off at a and you can't change it for my phone to go off at nine it's just a set time but it's handy if they've got um an now tv box in the bit in the bedroom and a playstation or a tablet and you can just lock all three to go off at eight o'clock no matter what they're on but anyway, leave um, any questions in the comments if you need any more help with it. And um, don't forget to sub, don't forget to like. See you later. Bye bye.